How's it going guys? Welcome back to a brand new episode of I Rate Your Teams. For cheap, fast and reliable FIFA 20 Ultimate Team coins, check out u7buy.com and use code HABER to get yourself 5% off all of your orders. If you guys have been living under a rock, maybe you just don't know, uh, the other day Icon Swaps 3 dropped. Now, in Icon Swaps 3 for 9 tokens, which is not a lot of tokens, uh, there was a Prime Icon pack available and uh, that allows you to pack any Prime Icon from the set of Prime Icons that we have. And you could have, you could literally get it now if you want. You, you it took nine tokens out of the twelve possibly available from the first uh, batch. So we're going to see a lot of that today. Uh, we're going to see a lot of people that have that have got their prime icons and changed their teams uh, around due to their prime icons and what they've got. Uh, so I thought I would uh, touch upon that early and uh, and talk to you guys about it. I highly recommend if you guys have the time to get the nine tokens and get yourself uh, a prime icon pack. I think it's definitely worth it. Excuse me. And uh, I, I'm not going to lie to you. I have run the foot market on on my other monitor right now watching him open prime pack. So if I look over like that, it's because he's opened a prime icon pack and I want to see who he gets for people. I'm so intrigued by them. I just think they're incredible. Let me know down below if you guys opened a prime icon pack who you guys got. So we're going to start off with Tristan's team. He says, hi, Haber. I've got 300k for upgrades. My untradables are Figo, Hiera, Aguirre, uh, Rusion to Stegen, Gattuso, Coutinho, uh, and then getting Maldini from swaps. Keep it the good work. Thank you very much, bro. I appreciate that. So that's what he plays in game, and this is what he starts. Now, obviously, that's uh, uh, Figo is the middle one. He's not the prime one. So he's not done the prime micro pack. He got Gattuso from swaps instead. For 300k with upgrades, what I think that you could do with this team is upgrade your Varane to a better version of Varane. Uh, Varane's got a bunch of different special cards this year. Like, I think he's got two or three different informs. He's got headliners. Uh, how much is the most expensive inform Varane? So that one's 383 or 291 on Xbox. You're on PlayStation, though. Um, so you could go with the... You could, like, grind to get the extra 80k to get the second inform or just get the first inform. I actually do think that he will improve your squad as well. I think that this is an improvement on the base card. Uh, so whichever one you can... Uh, get towards i would get the uh the informed version of varan and then sort of long term um players you want to you want to upgrade to obviously you'll be able to sell that varan when you get maldini you get like 300k in the club i think that you work on maybe upgrading coutinho uh one card that i really like the look of and he's actually a lot cheaper than than i expected is his prime moments haji he's about 800k right now and he's dropping as well uh five star skills four star weak foot good pace good dribbling good shooting good passing uh i think he'd be a fantastic cam uh, so I would say if you guys are looking for a decent cam that you want to play out on the left to start with and bring him inside, uh, I think this is a really good option to go with. Uh, so I'd highly recommend it. Uh, but I think you've got a very nice team here. Uh, a very nice team indeed. Uh, moving on now, we've got we've got Blinks, uh, who says, uh, I've got 60,000 coins and all the icons are untradeable. I got a smile call from the pack. Unlucky, bro. Um, getting Gattuso from swaps next week. Love the bits. Hey, thank you, man. I appreciate the support. So... I mean, that's actually an interesting team. I haven't seen a lot of people use that Aranguiz card. I'll be honest with you. That's the first time I've ever seen that Aranguiz card. I didn't even know that he had an inform. Uh, sorry, that, I might, that he had a man of the match. Uh, I think he got it recently, though. Um, that's a decent card, to be fair. He's got two, actually. I mean, you could upgrade to the 87 Aranguiz for literally 8k more. Just sell that Aranguiz and get the 87 one. It's like, it's like 7, 8k more. Um, there's an upgrade in itself straight away. I would also say that you're playing three CDMs here. I'm not entirely sure I like that. Willem Carvalho is not a, uh, a cam. Uh, what I would say with this is obviously you have the freedom to get any Portuguese player or any uh, any La Liga player. Uh, in terms of Portuguese cams, I've got to say, I, I really do think there'll probably be, be some... Oh, hang on, Nick's opening the prime icon pack. Argentinian. Sorry, I'm not going to ruin it for you guys. <laughs> um in terms of uh let's have a look real quick i want to look for portuguese camps because i feel like there actually might be some good options to go for uh any i mean there's bruno fernandez you can get a version of his card um you can literally get any version so you can get this 87 version that plays still for uh for uh for port not porto um Oh my god, what what is that? What is this? What is his team called? Sporting. There we go. I didn't want to actually cheat and look. Uh so you could get this card. This would be a decent card as a cam. Uh there's obviously obviously different options you can go with as well. Uh there's probably a few good center forwards or strikers as well that are Portuguese that you might be uh worth having a look at. But yeah, I I definitely say upgrade your uh your Willem Carvalho. The next team, the next team, the next team coming from Anthony, who says, I've got 200,000 coins and the second is in game looking to get Puyol or Mardini to replace Van Dijk. So I'm guessing that that Doug Leash is from your prime icon pack, which if it is, GG, that is an incredible prime icon to get. Um, let's have a look. So, oh, that's actually, a, I mean, it's, a, it's a definitely a good looking team. 
Um, I do like the look of the team. I would say with this team, uh, I see why you'd get Puyol. I wouldn't get Puyol though. I'd go for Maldini. It's just a few extra tokens uh, for a wildly better player in my opinion. Uh, but I would definitely go with Maldini there. I'd also maybe look to upgrade your Cyprian at some point. Um, there's some decent center mids in the icon swaps that you can look at. Uh, I'd definitely look at getting one of those to upgrade your Cyprian because I think that Cyprian, although he's not the worst, hmm. You know, he could be upgraded in my opinion. Definitely could be upgraded uh, to a better player. But I like your team a lot. Definitely like it. Uh, the next one coming from Mingus who says, Love the content, bro. This is my team. Uh, Alan, Politano, Dalbert, Louise, and Essien are untradeable. Uh, I've got around 2 million coins. What should I upgrade to next? Well, if you got Essien from last uh, last swaps, icon swaps, uh, and you grind it all the way to Essien, do the Prime Icon Pack and see what you get. Uh, one thing that I will always have advice for, and the reason why I'm such an advocate for, get, for doing the Prime Icon Pack, yeah, you could get something good, you could get something bad. Um, but what I think is, if you get something, for example, looking at this team right now, it's a very nice team, but if you were to get, for example, a Hullet, that changes the dynamic of your team massively. You can play Hullet over on your as your right cam and play Mer like or sorry as your left cam uh, instead of Allen, and then you can change up your left side of the pitch entirely. Uh, you can change up your striker. You can change up your other cam. You can change up what you're doing with the whole team. Uh, say you've got a striker, you replace uh, Mertens, for example. That allows you to change up your right your right side a whole lot as well. You can go for a Dutch right wing. Uh, or you can go for a different right back. Like I think that. The, the point I'm trying to get across is uh, it's a you know it's a, it's a risk in my opinion but I think that the reward is so great and the idea of getting an amazing icon uh, is so great that I think it's worth it and it will change your team up completely I think that when you get something that completely changes your team up it makes the game a lot more fun as well uh, so that's why I'm uh, such an advocate for doing the prime icon pack but in terms of uh, the rest of the coins two million coins to upgrade this team uh first things first get yourself a better left back there's much better uh, brazilian left backs in my opinion than dalbert uh do that the alexandro sbc he's absolutely phenomenal um i'd also say get yourself uh a version of um i forget what his name is my mind's gone blank today i'm i'm i bonus with you guys uh i'm moving house right now in the middle of moving house i'm getting this video up whilst i'm moving house zambrotta there's his name uh get zambrotta for right back and then uh and and get the strong link and stuff like that. But I'm in the middle of moving house right now. It's been so stressful. For the last three nights in a row, I've had to do four-hour drives to the new house to take stuff over and things. I'm so tired and my mind's so frazzled. I do apologize if I, my mind goes blank in this video. Uh, the next one coming from John. I love that profile picture so much. It's so great. Uh, he says, uh, this is my team. Love your Vidsky with the good work. Thank you. I've got 200,000 coins. They're all untradeable except for wan Saka, Mina, and Hinestrosia uh, and Borja. Uh, I can do uh, 12 icon swaps. Don't really want to do more. First photo is with Kem. Second is in-game. Let's check it out. You play a five back in game. That's very interesting. Uh, well, if you could do 12, I'd say go for the icon pack. I'd also say, uh, let me have a look at, at prices um, for this card. This is a card I think you should work towards. If you really want to play, a, uh, uh, sorry, if you really want to play a five back, this right here is a card you should work towards. I think that this card will double up really well as a center back. Uh, so I would say, Get rid of Roy Keane when you can uh, to bring in that Desai card. Uh, it's going to take you a little bit of time grinding and saving up, but I think it's definitely going to be worth it in the long run. Uh, what else would I do with this team? Um, then maybe just try and get a better, better centre-back here. Uh, no, actually, no. He's the guy with really good pace, isn't he? No, keep him. Ignore me. He's Kimmich. Uh, keep him. Um, yeah, no. The re Oh, sorry. The rest of the team is really good. I like the rest of the team. It's nice. Uh, yeah, it's a decent team. Uh, the next one, <laughs> unlucky Jake. The next one coming from Harry, who says, I've got 400k, whole team is untradeable apart from Stegen and Mason Greenwood. Uh, I packed Zola from my prime, prime pack, GG. That's a very good one to get. And I'm willing to grind for Maldini and more coins if I need to. Much appreciated, love the vid. Thank you very much, Harry. Uh, Harry? Harry, appreciate it, man. Uh, this team looks great. The, the, the setup is fantastic. Zola is a fantastic pool to get in the, uh, in the icon uh, pack. Uh, what I would say with this team, uh, I would say... Look to upgrade your left back. Um, don't get me wrong. I don't think he's terrible, but I think you could definitely do better. Uh, I'd also say maybe upgrade Nesta. Um, looking at the team, who could you get instead of Nesta? You could get a different goalie and go with a Prem right centre back. Maybe you go with... Uh, hmm, who could you go with here as a Prem centre back? I mean, obviously Van Dijk comes to mind straight away. Uh, but I think there's other options. I mean, Ake's uh, winter refresh is a decent option too. That you can grind towards. Um, this obviously Kante, but it's if you want Kante or not. Uh, there's David Louis. Oh no, that's a flashback card. I thought it was a shapeshifter for a second. I'm, I'm, I'm silly. My bad. My bad, guys. 
Um, who else is there? Yeah, I mean, there's Future Stars Tomori. This is a really good option as well. Uh, this guy is really difficult to play against in-game. Uh, you can go for him at right centre-back and then get yourself a new goalie. Maybe go with the likes of an Allison. Um, that could work really well. Uh, I think you've got a lot of freedom to change things around in this team as well, which is really cool. So, yeah, I'd, I'd definitely work towards that. Um... <laughs> oh, Andreas. Oh, I love it. I love it. He just sent me a gif of... Uh... Of, of Adrian, obviously, Liverpool, Atletico. That's all I'm going to say. Uh, next team is from Liam, who says, Just Pat Veron. Don't know if I should sell. I play the same in game. I've got 100,000 coins. The tradables are Kante, Veron, Desai, and Ben Yedda. Ooh, you just Pat Veron. Well, GG on the on the icon moments pack pool. Uh, this is a nice team. I like it. I like when people use a 4 2 2 It's a really good formation. I would say, first things first, get yourself a new goalkeeper. I would honestly say go with either Berkey or Sommer. I think that getting full Kem on Zakaria will actually do wonders for the team. Goalkeepers off Kem, in my opinion, are absolutely awful. So I would go for a goalkeeper and get, get Zakaria on Kem whilst you're at it. Um, I think that'll that'll be beneficial to the squad. Uh, I'd sell Veron. I don't think Veron's fantastic this year. I'd also look to maybe do the Prime Icon Pack or bring in uh, maybe Moments Lampard if you're looking to get a, a midfielder, a solid midfielder, or get yourself Loudrup maybe. Uh, that could also work. Get yourself Moments Loudrup would work as a Cam. Um, the rest of the team solid though. You got really good foundations of this squad. Uh, I think just upgrading certain players like Kante to a better version of Kante, maybe um, upgrading Alwar at some point to an icon. Uh, that sort of thing will work really well for your team. The next one coming from Eric, who says, "This is my team. I got about 200k, and I'm doing the prime icon pack." Eric, send me your team when you've done the prime icon pack, so I know what you've got, and then we can work from there. I think that'll probably be way easier to to work on because you might get yourself the likes of a Desai and replace Upper Mencano, for example, or you might get yourself the likes of a Garincha that replaces your right your, your Fuenza leader, or you might get a Prime R9 to use up front. You know, like things like that. I'd say definitely complete the prime icon pack uh, and then resubmit your team. Uh, so I can check it out and uh, and give you thoughts when you've done uh, the Prime Icon Pack, really. Next one coming from Ethan, who says, uh, Hi, everyone is untradeable. I play 4 2 one in game. I've got 100,000 coins to spend. Okay. Um, by the way, this is this has been a glitch all day, this not found stuff. That's, you know, I, I don't know why it's just been like that. Uh, I would say with 100k, can't really improve this squad massively. I would re I, I'd upgrade Adama Traore to second inform form Wambasaka. I would also probably upgrade Luke Shaw to a better left back. There's probably options out there for, for less than 100k. Um, I'd say just look around at what you think fits your uh, left back play style the best. Uh, and then I would say work towards icon swaps. Easy. There you go, mate. Uh, next one coming from NFL Newton, who says, uh, here's my team, CL7 uh, Mbappe Edair Tradable. Uh, just packed Primer Rio from uh, from Ramos. So two point you packed Prime Moments Rio from the Ramos SBC, so 2.3 mil to improve. I that's insane. And you've got Zola uh, in the prime pack. Mate, this is where the pack look goes, if you guys are wondering. Uh, this is an insane team. This team is absolutely phenomenal, mate. Uh, what I would say with this team is upgrade your Firmino to... Uh, where are you playing Firmino? You're playing him cam, right? Oh, sorry, centre mid. You're playing him centre mid. Interesting. Uh, well, you've got 2.3 mil. Get yourself Matthias, mate. Honestly, Matthias is fantastic this year as a centre mid. Get him. Get middle Matthias, uh, as I don't think you can afford the prime one yet. You might be able to afford the prime one. How much is the prime one? Lotha Matthias. The middle one is about 1.3. Yeah, what's a prime? Oh, you can afford the prime. Yeah, get prime Matthias, mate. Get prime Matthias. Put him there for your centre mid spot. That's a huge improvement to the squad. The next one is coming from Will, who says, Hi, Haber. I've got 200,000 coins, and the untradables are Sizoko, Arnold, Sanchez, Foyth, and Sane. Thanks, and have a nice day. Thank you, Will. I'll, I'll do my best to have a nice day. Uh, thank you very much for the support, bro. I really appreciate it. Um, let's check it out. Uh, I just want to see who, uh, who Nick gets in this pack right now. I'm not going to ruin it. Um, well, this is actually a nice team. Interesting. Very nice team. Uh, what I would say with this team, obviously icon swaps, get the prime icon pack or get yourself an icon that you want to use. Straight away, do that. Uh, with 200k, get yourself second in form Wan-Bissaka at right back. Get yourself uh, the team of the year nominee, Alex, uh, not Alex, uh, uh, Robbo. I forget what his first name is. I'm having a, I'm having a mare today. Uh, get Robbo's team of the year nominee at left back. Um... I would also say get Winter Refresh Ake at left centre back if you can afford him. I don't actually know uh, quite how much this card is. Let me have, you have a look. Uh, I haven't checked this card in a little while. He is about 196. Yeah, you can't afford all of them. I'd say save towards getting Ake. I think Foyth isn't that bad, but I think Ake is a, a bit better, you know. Um, and then I just sort of save coins after that. 
Next one coming from Lee, who says, 4-2-2 and two and two in game. Gerard and Larissa are tradable. Got 50,000 coins. Drogba from the pack. Love the vids. Keep it the good way. Thank you very much, Lee. I appreciate that, mate. You got Drogba. That's a big dub. That's a really big dub. This is a nice team. Uh, the only thing I would say with this team... I mean, actually, no, I wouldn't. I wouldn't say anything like that. This is this team is 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 like an end game team, to be honest. Uh, just save and upgrade your icons to better versions, to be honest. Like this team is end game, mate. I, I have nothing else to say about this team. It's fantastic. It's a very nice team. <laughs> <laughs> oh my word! This man is a genius. I love him so much. This is hilarious. Thank you. You've you've. You've made my day. Uh, the next one coming from uh, 207 Axe, who says, uh, Hey, it's Haber. I have about 100k at the minute. Just looking for the future of Ray's Tiedemans and Aguero are tradable. Let's check it out. Well, I think I'd get rid of both of them, to be honest. That'll give you, what, so you're on 100k. Tiedemans is what, like, I don't know how much this card is. This card is 236k, so it gives you 336. Then Aguero is... Uh, Aguero is 45. That gives you about 380k. I would say replace Aguero with um, Prime Moments Loudrup from Icon Swaps, unless you want to go for the pack, then go for the pack. And then replace Tielemans with uh, a good version of Kante, to be honest. And then your team is really, really set. Uh, the next one coming from uh, Siam, who, or, or Sean, I think he just spelled his name wrong, uh, who says, Hi, it's Haber. The second pick is what I play in game. All untradeable, but Bruno. Uh, I need a striker, to be honest, because uh, I took over miles from Icon Swaps and will grind when the next batch comes out. 200k to improve. Any suggestions? By the way, love the vids. Well, thank you very much, man. It's the first person I've actually seen take over Mars. It's a nice looking card, to be fair, so I don't blame you. Uh, what I would say with this team, it's a very nice team, don't get me wrong. Uh, get Varane over Adair Militao, definitely. Um, and then I I would hold tight until you do icon swaps because only icons are going to improve this squad after that. Uh, the squad's very nice, and uh, obviously Chem is so temperamental. Chemistry is that I think you've got to sort of. I mean, you, I guess you could go instead of Bruno. You could go with like a De Bruyne uh, if you really wanted to. Wait, De Bru Wait, Bruno is striker. Hang about, mate. Hang about. What is this? Get yourself second in form. Uh, oh, sorry. Get yourself uh, in form. Um, Gabriel Jesus over uh, Bruno to play a striker, mate, because Bruno's not a striker in this game. Next one coming from Ollie Lloyd, who says, this will be my team. Drogba from Prime Icon Pack. GG, that's a, that's a good pull. Uh, Lippmann and Puyol from Icon Swaps next week. Any improvements? Ooh, okay. Uh, I wouldn't... I mean, there's not really any other option than Puyol, is there? So I'm not going to say that. Uh, I mean, it's a nice team. Don't get me wrong. Very nice team, to be fair. Uh, I like it. I, I don't really have any, uh, any qualms against this squad. It's a very nice squad. Uh, the next one comes from Alexander who says, should I get this squad? Everyone's untradeable. Yes, go for it. It's a nice squad. I like that a lot, actually. It's a decent squad, mate. Uh, the next one comes from uh, Emil who says, Mertens, Allen, and Dembele are tradable. Uh, I've got 350,000 co coins in the bank. Love the vids. Keep it the good work. Let's check it out. Hmm. Interesting. Uh, let me just double check this. Mertens, Allen, and Dembele. Wait, Emil, uh, did, I, did I get you Nakata from the Prime Icon Pack? I feel like I got I was the one that got you Nakata from the Prime Icon Pack. What I would say with this team is probably work to get a better right wing at some point. Um, I'd also say, well, yeah, no, I'd just say that really. The rest of the team is really solid. The rest of the team is really solid. Maybe maybe just start saving coins and eventually get yourself like a, a version of Best or Grincher. Uh, both would be big improvements. Or wait for a decent SBC to come out, to be honest. Um, Andreas, again... Thank you. Thank you very much. Uh, the next one coming from D Savvy says, Hello, it's Haber. Uh, this is better quality. I was thinking of selling Mount and getting Mares. I've got 50,000 coins. Uh, thinking of getting Loudra from the swaps instead of Lacazette. Yeah, do that 100%. Uh, or get yourself Trezeguet, whichever one you want, really. Uh, I think Trezeguet is more of a, an out and out striker than, uh, than Loudra, but whichever one you like the look of more, in my opinion. Um, the rest of the squad's solid, though. I'd say just uh, try and improve your left back and right back when you can. Uh, yeah, I'd probably just say do that, to be honest. Um, and then eventually upgrade Mason Mount to a better cam, and you're sorted. So very nice team. Maybe get yourself uh, Loudrup and... Um, like, uh, and Sorry, get yourself Loudrup and Trezeguet uh, from the next two... When the second uh, set of tokens come out, and then you can uh, you can upgrade your mount to, uh, to Loudrup there as well. Uh, the next team coming from Top Cam for the Strimps, who says... Uh, 
My whole team is untradeable. Uh, I'm getting Maldini in Icon Swaps and I packed Cliver in the Prime Pack. That's good. You've got a sad face, but I'd say that's a really good pack. I've got 350k and I'm looking uh, to get either Gerald or Roy Keane as a replacement for Pep. Keep up the good work. Thank you very much, man. All right, check it out. Uh, what would I do with this team? Good question. I mean, yeah, replacing Pep's probably a good shout. I think Clive has a good pull. I really do. I think I think Clive has a very good pull. I would say eventually look at getting a better right mid. But that, like, I think Adam is a better super sub than he is a starting player. But apart from that, the team is really solid. Yeah, just 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 work on getting the icon swap tokens. Really. Uh, we're going to end it off with uh, Kethal's team, who says, I've got 150k to spend. Uh, Hierro, Rusion, Van der Sar, Alwar, and the bench are all untradeable. In game, I switch Ben Yedder and Tzoko, and then Ben Yedder and Tzoko. What? In game, I switch Ben Yedder and Tzoko, and then Ben Yedder and Tzoko. Okay. I'm going to guess you mean. Okay, where's Tzoko? Ben Yedder, Tzoko, and then Ben Yedder and Son, I'm guessing. Uh, regardless, I think the team's pretty cool. What I would say with this team is. Uh, I would just say try and upgrade Zoko if you can. I get why you've got him, obviously, linked to Son. You might be better off trying to get yourself the likes of uh, Moments Gattuso, for example, from Icon Swaps, and then play Son off Chem. That might be a better option, in my opinion, because I don't think Zoko's normal card is usable anymore. But apart from that, I like this quite a lot. And I'm actually going to do Miguel's team, because I, I always feel bad if uh, someone's team shows, as I say, to last squad, because I, like, I feel like if you don't know you're the next one, then... You know, you're not, you're not missing out on anything. But if you do, then it's probably going to feel really bad. So this is Miguel's team. He says, uh, this is my team. Second picture is in game. I've got 100k and my whole team, other than Alexandro, uh, isn't tradable. I'm completing Vidal flashback and icon swaps. And I'm completing Gattuso and Overmars. Thanks for the good work. Keep it up. Thank you very much, man. I appreciate that. I would say, I wouldn't say go for Overmars if you're completing flashback Vidal. You don't need Overmars, really. Uh, I would say get Loudrup or get... Uh, if you're going for icon swap tokens, get yourself louder up or grind a little bit more and get Burkamp maybe um, and upgrade your strike force. I think you're better off doing that than get yourself two CDMs really because uh, that Vidal card will be incredible for the rest of the year. Uh, but that's a nice team. I do like the team a lot and I like the use of, for example, flashback uh, Alexis Sanchez and, and Kubo and things like that. It's a nice team. It's well built. Um, I think that, uh, you know, I think eventually maybe when this the second set of tokens comes out, upgrading your PK to the likes of Maldini might be a good shout as well. Um, but yeah, the rest of the team is solid, mate. And I, I like it a lot. And that's it for this episode. Now, I don't know if you noticed or not, but I tried to make this episode a little bit quicker paced uh, where I go into squads a little bit faster. Um, hopefully you guys enjoy that format a little bit more. I see a lot of people saying, you know, I spend a little bit too much time umming and ahhing on squads and things. And I get that totally. So I thought I'd do this to see what you guys think. Uh, let me know in the comments down below if you prefer the quicker paced or if you prefer me to spend a little bit more time on each team. Uh, I'd love to uh, hear your feedback. Thank you all for the epic support on the channel recently. You guys are amazing. I'll see you later.